Hello again, everyone. It is your Black Knight. And we're going to zap back over to the garage over here. I've done a couple K.O. Pericos here. Just finally got through them. There's a video coming. It's, it's a long story. Long, painful story as the K.O. Pectate heist always is. But it is Black Friday. And there's a couple Black Friday sales. There's one in particular that I want to partake in. And here you can see one of the, the from last week's sale. I've got my my green wood done up in like 70s gold with a white vinyl top. I'm happy with the way that came out. But if we look here at the uh, we'll go on the internet, go over to legendary, assume, and that is a huge sale on the SM722, which is a mediocre sports car. Are you bored? Horny, constipated? Here are four easy steps to all-around instant relief. Buy the car. New open cockpit speedster from Manufacturer. Start the engine. Place your foot on the right, far right pedal. Twitch. You won't be able to believe what happens in step five. Okay. We're going to order that because 1.2 million is, you know, we've got ourselves back to 136 million, so we can play with this a little bit. Even though there is a DLC coming in a couple weeks, I think we can afford this, and I've got plans. Got plans. And we'll, we'll do the time warp again here. All right, and here it is. And it is a rather fetching car. It's not going to be a perfect representation of the McLaren SLR that Tyler Hoover just bought. But he did get it on quite a sale, just as I got this on quite a sale, because his had been on fire. At least had some kind of electrical fire in the trunk. Which, you know, with cars like this, that, that matters. Yeah, we're going to play with this a little bit. I don't know exactly how close an homage I'm going to be able to do here, because it's... Really, just the front end and the back end that really match. It's like the whole top part is, is show car. Front bumpers. Ooh, this is the kind of thing where I'm going to have to kind of pull up the internets here. Hold on, internet. Okay, believe it or not, that kind of works. It's it's not perfect, but it's, nothing's perfect here. But it does kind of work. Rear bumper. Not a lot of differences there. I think I'm going to go with the racer diffuser just because it has that little bit of primary to it. Engine, rev it up. Exhaust. Again, I don't know that this is going to be something we can make. I don't have a good look at the rear of the car here. On the internet. The front's really the party piece for the thing. As I recall, the, it's, it's the side exit exhaust that were a big deal for for his. He had the side exits dumping right off the, you know, the sides. So we're going to go side exits on this. The hood. Speed hood. Let me see. Do I have a better... His hood looks pretty, pretty tame. None of the hood options are particularly tame. We'll leave. I think I think we'll go with the speed hood. That's just it's just attractive. We haven't really got a neon layout. That's that's a performance enhancing thing. Livery. Now I'm I'm open to getting silly with this. Like to do something that Tyler might do. For my Hoobies Garage homage garage. Arrow green. Some of these are nice. Ooh. Very Holy Cross. Over in Dunmore. Vale. Whip it. Whip it good. Dun 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 dun. Fading bands. Speed. I am speed. Okay, I think we're going to leave it this way and just go with the... We'll do a true Hoobies Homage Garage 
Uh, let's see. It's a really shiny silver here for the primary. Metals. Like brushed aluminum probably captures the look about as well as you could. We'll take a look though at the, the metallic silvers. I'm not sure that captures the look. I think we have to go with the metal. Brushed aluminum. I think that, looking at what's on the internet, that kind of captures it. I don't think you can go pearlescent on that. Secondary color. What is the secondary color? Is there anything secondary on this car? picking nothing up. Nothing looks bronze on here, does it? Bright orange? I mean, bright, we should be able to see bright orange. Maybe there's parts you could put on it, but we haven't gotten there yet, so we're just going to let that go. Trim color. Okay, so this is something. Can we get... I might have to go to the video itself. It looks like he's just got a black interior on this. Yeah, it's a black interior. Let's leave it alone. Leave it at, leave it at graphite or go deeper black. I think go deeper black. Roof accessories. Okay. None of this is close because he just has a also he has like a, a windscreen. So none of that's now. Let's leave that alone. Splitters. Oh, we went through bumpers and now there's splitters? I don't think I'm going to do a splitter. Skirts. Unless there's something pretty subtle here. Well, I that. Those are subtle. But yeah, nothing. I think stock kind of looks more like what his car hit has. Spoiler, you need something. Probably the lip spoiler. Ooh, a primary lip spoiler. I think just yeah, keep it real subtle there. And you can get crazy. Suspension. Give it street suspension. Good. Lowered pretty good here. For what it is, I mean, it's, you know, probably to match his. Stock probably works better. But the newer cars, you need that as a performer. You get more grip for some reason. Not all of them. It might be pointless, but we're not going to... Wheels. Now, the wheels to match his... Here. Let's see. Wheel type. High end. And we'll go with, you know... I guess we'll go with alloys for the time being. Because his look shiny, but they look like they match the car shiny. Not necessarily chromes. Now, these are kind of more of a swirly whirly kind of thing. Light that but not directional like that, but not. Okay, let's try track. Sport. I haven't touched sport in a while. Tuner. I think we might be striking out on rims that look like hoovies. Street. Rack. Lost the whole thing there, okay. Well, Mr. Hoover, you 
you've got some unique wheels. I think we we can definitely say that. So, what do we want to do? Let's go back to sport. So, Mercies might be a good... Synthetic Zs are not too far bad. Organic type O's, no, not really. That might be as close as we're going to get. Some Ushios. Not even worry about the color. Let's see, wheel color. Can we make them more silver? I think they're probably the stock alloys as good as it's going to get. Yeah, let's leave them alone. They, that match is pretty close. Tires, tire enhancements. That tire design, no. We'll leave them black. Leave the tire smoke alone. No window, so there's no... We can't make them you know, put light smoke. I think we've got everything. We're done here. Let's set our course. Oh, of course, it's raining. This should be it. This should be the way to the Ubi's garage. The Ubi's garage, homage garage. And that's the guy. That's probably it's either a car to steal or. Don't you kick out on me now. I'm trying to record. I'll take an extra seven grand. Looting the sleeping guard. This is how you get the key to get the gun. The golden gun. It's always like this right in his rear end. There you go. Scoop that out there, you. And he, apparently he has $7,007 in his butt. That, 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 that metallic silver looks really odd in the rain, doesn't it? In this kind of light. I still think it's as close as we're going to get. I mean, it's not a slow car, but I, I, again, I don't... Oh, well, I missed my turn. I didn't go that way. It's the rain in my face doing it. The rain in my face. Let's see how it looks in the, uh, the homage garage. I picked the right building. I'm not sure I did. But we're gonna find out. There's so many properties. It's so hard to keep track. This one is the homage garage. Try to try to do a, a turbo booster. I don't know why it stopped. Usually they're just trying to kill you. Okay. Go up here. Ooh. And it fills a nice spot. Is this a Dubsta 2? Yeah, it is. We've got a Dubsta 2, which I think he had one of those. Um, we have a selection of Lamborghinis. This one was I, one I won off the uh, the wheel there, the prize wheel. So I left it in its original pink. We're just parking here because he has one. It's, did he sell that one? He might have sold this one, but... And he has a white Quintosh. I couldn't break up the three Quintoshes, so. And this is as close as I'm going to get to his Mercy, because it's the only open top Pegasi here. So we went with that, and we tried to make that as orange as possible. The purple the Rolls Royce, there's an homage to that. This is the car that was owned by all three of them him and Ed and Tavarish, who he currently has it. This is his homage to his current purchase that he just got. 
And I think we have one spot left in here once you get past the G-Wagon. I mean, there are other cars that have Hoovy uh, similarities, but we, if we're going to go look for them, we should get something something that will be okay in the rain. Let's let's take the the G wagon here. Okay, the G wagon, it don't mind the rain. Because they do have Yeah, I guess it doesn't mind the rain. It's sliding around. Uh, I ended up getting this some special there. I can't remember what it was. Oh, this is one you could buy it from Simeon. And it was a Dub City, so I went there. Which does remind me of another thing that I want to do today. I'm spending lots of money. Blowing money left and right. I'm about to do another KO Paranoia. KO Pectate Heist. Not that any of it matters, you know? Now this is my, my Matchbox Hot Wheels homage garage. I do have one particularly big car. Ugh, like a big uh, die cast of this, this Mercedes. Which this could easily go in Hoovy's garage, homage garage as well as well as this Mercedes over here. But since they're both, you know, it overlaps with the, in the Venn diagram with the uh, matchboxes I had, toys I had as a kid, I put them in this garage. As well as these, these are all matchbox cars too, so. It's all good. Let us grab 762 here because it is bulletproof. That might be as a good general thing to have. But now we're going to take a, a quick drive downtown. And let's do the time warp again. Alright, where are we at here? There we go. So let's see, I'm recording, it's recording. So, never mind the Deluxo over here, because we've already got one of those. We have almost exactly that car. Obviously, it's a different silver, but I mean, we have that car. This over here, I think we have... We have we have one, but apparently, you see that, that gold kind of, you know, weird livery there? Apparently, this is the only way you can get that livery. So, this is like an ultra-rare car, because you cannot get that just by in, in Los, you know, in Los Santos Customs. And as kind of a collector slash complete kind of guy, that is something that interests me. Look at this. Is that like officially gold leaf, would you call that? I mean, it's not particularly good. It's not good gold. I mean, it might be one that got rejected, I guess, and then... <laughs> it's not bad. It's not that bad. I'm just saying. Would I pick this if, you know, if it was just in the list? Probably not. But to have it, because this is the only way you'll ever get it. Unless they do something else later. You never know. It's all digital. How much? 1.38 mil... You know, basically 1.4 million. Where have I got room? Let's put it in Office Garage 1. I know that there's room there. And we will uh, we'll take a ride up there. It's a deity. I mean, we have deities. We think, isn't, don't I have a Christmas deity? I guess this would be a daily deity. And Office Garage 1 is close. Well, it's quicker than it usually is. Oh, yeah. oh, my God. 
We're almost there. Let's go build this sucker. I'm not gonna duplicate this on around the other character because neither of those two cars are anything other than just a quick collector's item kind of thing. They're not turbo useful for racing or anything like that. Let's see. We'll take it up from mods. <laughs> I don't. I don't. I'm not fond of the gray, but is it like a specific gray that you can't get otherwise? Let's let's leave all that. We're just gonna rev it up for right now. I might I might do something else with it later on. Engine revs, exhaust. Yeah, stock exhaust is fine. Grill. Hood. Eh. Lights. Neon kit. Neon layout. Bang bang. Goes with the gray. Livery. See now. It's gone. You can't get it. Like I think even you, you go. You, you can take it away. But you can't go stock so you can't touch that or it goes away Light we spray I'm making primary anything. color I assume that's something I don't know that looks a little different I mean that's I guess it's a it's, it's it looks guess it's a mat no it's not a mat is it a metallic yeah metal rather well it might be a brush black steel, but it's not quite, is it? So there's something, it might be, it's, it's almost like they put a pearlescent over the black steel. So we're going to leave all that alone. Roof. Ooh, primary roof we might do. So you can get all, a little bit more of that. Stock roof is there. See what are we other? What are we other? What are the other options here? Carbon roof. Carbon roof kind of keeps the black going and leaves no it on there. That's kind of nice. There's some continuity here. I'm somehow the carbon. <coughs> I don't normally go carbon. Carbon does call to me. <coughs> stock skirts, stock skirts, stock skirts are kind of nice. Spoiler: We need one. Whatever Lip spoiler. Technology and budget permit. Yeah, NASCAR ducktail. That's not going to make a lot of sense on here. Let's go secondary lip spoiler. Because why not? I say, why not? Slam this puppy. Turbo it up. Wheels. Oh, let's just do tires and tire hand for cloth. Windows, of course we have to do light smoke. And there we are. Let's let's exit to let's exit to the garage first. We can take a look at it there. Let's see the motor hanging down underneath there. That's interesting. And so that's the newest addition. I'm not sure where it should live in the long run. Well apparently this is gonna be like an ultra rare thing to have. Not that it's necessarily a good thing to have, but it's, uh... I don't know if they're going to be doing that more and more often just to get you to spend a million and a half dollars on a car. 
almost two million that just for a livery that you can't get otherwise. Yeah, let's take it. Let's take a shot down and look at the other ones. Is there anything else over? Let's do the time warp again. And it was in this gap here where I drove down to Simeon's and uh, did a couple other things, looked at the cars there. And I talked about, let's click a button, Joe is Gaming. And this is kind of, this is the video where I, I, I got the idea for getting the rare car. And I, I gave him a lot of credits and we talked about stuff and I was going to put things up here and stuff like that. Apparently I wasn't recording. I, I thought I stopped it from recording and there was this long section where I didn't know I was recording and then I got out of, basically out of phase where I, I was stopping recording, I was starting it and I doing the opposite of what I thought and you'll, you'll see later in the video I lost more stuff than that because of that I got a bunch of clips that were absolutely useless and uh, we're unfortunately, uh, not, I lost a bunch of stuff that I planned. So. Subscribe to this guy. We're going to subscribe to him right here. Watch this. Subscribed. And so, we'll, do we ding the dinger? Yes. We'll, we'll ding the dinger for all. Because that was very useful. Very useful, Joe. And now we return to your regular, regularly scheduled programming. Amazing, marvelous, stupendous, colossal, tremendous, gigantic, astounding, unbelievable, spectacular, phenomenal. And it's good, too. Side note. It's stuff like this that makes me think maybe I need to take a sabbatical for just just a little while. Just I've been saying that in videos for like weeks now, and I just keep doing. It's just what I keep doing. And I'm doing stuff like that, so I think I need to really start thinking about taking a break. Probably won't do it, but I need to at least think about it. Hello, my baby. Hello, my honey. Hello, my rag. I'm just Okay, I just did the hot lap route with the deity, and I don't know if it was recorded. Because I, I went to turn it off, I checked it, and it still stayed recording. So I don't know if it just ignored the fact that I didn't want it to record. So we're going to do this one, then we'll see if we have to do the other one. We'll see if we, we may or may not do that anyway. It was a good 10 minutes. Almost 11. Of my life lost. I really need a better way of recording. That probably involves more equipment. That, that's a Paragon, okay. I assume that's not a supercar. There we go. Custom as this is the, the Hoovy Garage. Can it go up? Oh, we're doing this at night. I forgot to change the weather. Oh well. I'll show off the lights. Okay, that didn't necessarily go well. It looks like a little speedboat. Um, do I have to drown? And now the train is there. Where is the best place to launch this? Not there. Although that might work. Suboptimal, and it would have crushed my head, but oh, this is this is slippery, slidey, slippy slides. Not winning with the train here. Wow, this thing is just. A handful. It's very wide. At least it feels like me, it's just zoomed in. Push the train along a little bit. I 
Where can we go? I think the train's too long. Oh, we did it! Almost launched it into the ether there if we, if we, if we didn't get past the train, but... The power's impressive. Let's take as much momentum as we can here. Yeet! Into a tree. No momentum at all. I don't think it's got the traction, but does it have the power? Sometimes the power is enough. Sometimes the power is just enough. Well, that was close. It was dicey, but it made it up. I think if this was not fully upgraded, it would not. I think it needed every ounce of its beam to, to get to that point. I didn't like that little blip there in the, in the frame rate. How much longer am I going to be working here, gang? Before it freezes up. Well, if it freezes up now, we'll just know that it can get to the top of Chile. Yeah, and that's a kind of a neat pose. And falling off Chile is really... Stop it. Stop it. Okay, I'm, I'm going to cheat here. Respawn. I know, it's evil and it fixes the car and it's... I hate but then I went down the wrong way. Yes. Yeah, I'm struggling with this puppy. It definitely lends itself to the Chiliad disaster, but I want to see how it does. Here we are going into Yeatsville. Oh, you know, sometimes you think it's going to be a bush instead of a tree, and it's a, it's a tree. Even though it's a little tree. Oh, we're just looping. Oh, that tree. Woo! Here we go. We've, we've lightened it. That was... It's gotten optimized. Oh dear, that's not where we wanted to know. See, this is where... Is my face in the ground? No, I'm bopping. Yeah, yeah it's, it's, it's in the ground, but I'm still bopping along to the music. A little beat up.
Not not great off road traction stuff, here, you know. I feel like we're gonna go Yeatsville here and just put it airborne. There's more opportunities coming up. That was close. Wow, this did not want to turn there. I don't know that I'd like to actually drive a car like this with like no windshield. You know, it's no windshield, no top. You need a helmet, I think, to drive fast. At least some really good goggles. Just made the jump. Not, not the smoothest. But not the not the worst thing either. All right, it's doable. Now I'm going to I'm gonna click like and hit replay, and now I'm gonna do the time over again while I check and see if I got the daddy. And no, we didn't. No, no, we didn't. That's really annoying. Cause I like to do it completely, kind of where I haven't. I have no idea what's going to happen. Let's make it cloudy. So I kind of know the outcome, but we're going to do it anyway. We're going to do it anyway, because I'm going to show you the outcome. That's really annoying when you, you think you're recording and you're not. At least it's something you, you know, easily... Well, I didn't do this the first time. Drat. Alright! Clint, this is really the biggest thing. I don't really know the best launch site there. That would have hurt the groin, but... Now... It doesn't have a lot of suspension drive. There was a rock. Isn't this exactly what I just did? Well, that was really harsh on the tush.
trying to get ahead of it. There's too many rocks. Well, great at this, uh, boys and girls. It is definitely going more interesting than it did last time. We're gonna we're gonna soak it here. Aren't we? This is not going to end well. Did not make it. We're not even to the part where I know it's, it's not going to like it. So. And we've trashed the car. I, I couldn't get it off the wall there for a second. Momentum! We have none. We're going to fall back in the train. It's close. It does not feel good. It didn't even feel as good as it did the first time when I didn't record it. So, let's see. If I've stanced it enough, will that mean it gets a little bit more power? Just so you know, it didn't, it didn't quite make it up when it was not beat to heck. By the way, I do not call myself a professional YouTuber. I'm not getting any dollars from the YouTubes. And this is about as well as it went last time. But I gave you the full experience here. It, it, uh, the damage does not matter in this. It, uh, it, did, not, uh, it did not go well. Now we're just fighting to get to a trail without going all the way back down the mountain. Which is what we're doing. Ow. It'd be funny if it just explodes. Come on here, you, you British thing. You, the Brits would require you to push forward, to move on, to get to the. It's right there. Oh goodness! We were so close. All right, there we go.
There we don't go. No, stop, 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 stop. Okay, they had to overcome some adversity, which the British are wont to do. They have some more coming up. A little bit more. Turn, please turn. Oh, this has gone the wrong way. It just wouldn't turn. Oh. Okay, more adversity. We're still working our way down. Falling is a thing, that's okay, we're... Well, I mean, the front and back are trash, but the sides look pretty good. I don't feel that physics is necessarily accurate at this point. Or what would really happen. I think we can safely say we have departed from that, but she's down. Well, let's take a moment to gather this in. Okay, just so you know, we're already 15 seconds past what took the other car to do it. We had the same car another time, where things went slightly better. 
This was more spectacular, I'll admit. Oh, it's got a pull, yeah. Definitely pulling. I can see the computer locking up at any time. Trying to get some frame drops. It's not likey. Ain't no likey this. Yeet! Use the tree to your advantage. And just go. Okay, 10.45 was the last time with this. So we have not done anywhere near as well. And the car is destroyed. Um, not something you'd want to attempt a, a Hail Mary in. And we're not going to anyway, because this, this particular track doesn't go that far. Yeah, there's some serious frame drops there. Can we get their speed back up enough to make this jump? It did make it on its own the first time, so the car can do it. Yep, just it did about as well. Yeah, it's a good, yeah, almost two minutes longer that time. Oh, man. We punished the poor thing. Is this still a good segment? Is this something that we want to do? Kids keep destroying these cars, going up and down chill yet? I do not know. I do know that this is where we're going to wrap it up, folks. On this note, ladies and gentlemen, this is your Black Knight. Have a great night.